Okay, YouTube family friends, welcome back to another edition of Mustang Fanatic Productions Mechanic Editions. Uh, mechanic is a word that we used 20 years ago when I was a diesel mechanic, so we just called ourselves Mechanics instead of Mechanics. So this is an edition of Mustang Fanatics Mechanic Editions. So we work on and solve mechanical issues and problems. So enjoy. Rev here with Rev It Up Mustang Fanatic Productions Mechanic Edition. Okay, here I have a buddy of mine's 2011 Cadillac DeVille DTS. He had brakes done at a professional shop, paid over $750 for rotors, brakes, and a caliber. And you can see the new brake hose. And these Cadillacs. Are supposed to be smooth and already I see what the problem is and he took this to a professional brake guy well if you look right down in here this brake hardware right here that pin is sliding on the rotor right there these pins have a tendency to do that and I'm surprised that this professional shop did not know that to get these pins to anchor down. And uh, this looks like it might be the new hardware or might be old hardware. But regardless, that pin right there is running, rubbing right up against the rotor right there. And I'll go underneath him. Well, the sun's in the eye. But you can see it right there where I'm pointing the screwdriver at. That right there is rubbing up against the rotor. And that's why you have the brakes squealing when they're brand new. And that's why he brought it to me. He wanted me to check it out. <sighs> Spent all that money. Oh, well. That's what you got to know. That's what you got to look for. There's no wear and tear on the brake pads. The brake pads are one are good. And the brakes slide in and out of the pin pretty easily. So um, the squealing wouldn't be in there. You know, it's, it's kind of grease, but those are the things you got to look for when you're do, doing brakes. Make sure these pins, there's like right here, the sun is kind of in my way. Got to make sure those pins, the hardware clips, are not rubbing against that rotor. And you want to make sure that your gre your brake hardware greased. Anywhere there's metal to metal contact, you got to grease those. And then you got to make sure the sliding pins, which are right here, the sliding pins are, are working great. And then you got to grease in here. That's where they also rub. So... Uh, that's a lesson in brakes, ladies and gentlemen. Rev it up, Mustang Fanatic Mechanic Edition. Okay, what I found on the passenger side, the hardware is not rubbing against the rotor, but the sliding pins weren't greased. And now I greased them. Watch how I pull it out and see how it comes back in. Plenty of movement. This one I had to re-grease too, but... There you go. They uh, slide back in. You want to make sure your sliding pins can slide. Then you have to put brake loop grease around there. Any surface that touch metal, that's where you want to put um, brake grease. And, you know, you can even make a circle around here. Because you know that's where the rotor, the... Um, the back of the brakes is going to hit the boost, the double um, pistons right there, and right against here, against here, against here, and they slide along that bracket there. So you want to make sure you put brake lube around these areas. Now this is going to solve his squeaky problem. And again, they didn't put grease on the pins. So I'm going to take this one out. 
dry as a bone dry as a bone they didn't put none in there anything where it's metal against metal it has to have lubricating grease now look at the difference with grease see how that brake pack can slide nice and easy it slides out on the top on the bottom and the back one slide with no problems that's what you want you want these things to be able to slide out and slide in and not have grease and dirt or uh, dirt build up on it and rust you have to lubricate these with brake glue so we're in the 2011 caddy dts now and uh we're taking it for a test drive make sure uh we got no squeals and uh so far she's got no squeals and guys the reason i haven't been making many videos lately as you know i am uh disabled and i have back problems and hip problems i have hip dysplasia and uh osteoarthritis in the hip had back surgery and so uh there's a lot of times i'm i'm down and can't do anything so uh we decided to take this little easy little thing here to help out out a friend and uh so far it seems good so uh we're gonna make sure we got no squealing before we call him and tell him he can pick up his quiet ride in cadillac again uh, these cadillac dcs cadillac is known for being smooth and quiet and uh we gotta have smooth and quiet with this big north star v8 in it uh one of the only things i like about it it's got the 4.6 liter V8, the same ones that the Mustangs use. So uh, it's got some pretty good power. Good smooth riding car. So uh, no squealing. It was squealing when the brakes, when you weren't on the brakes, it was squealing when you put your foot on the brakes. No squealing now. So uh, she sounds good. Rev it up, Mustang Fanatic Productions, Mechanic Edition. Be blessed.